Vlog every day in May right now with Matt Matt UK. Yee-haw! Thank you very much. Hey YouTube, this is Vlog Every Day in May Day 24. Whoop! 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 Um, I got up today, I had to, like, I had to get up really early. I got up at 5.30 to have a shower. Woo! Oh! 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 And, um, oh, strange device. I might do the vlog with this in the re my eye for the rest of the game. Anyway, so I got up, I had a shower, I went to work, and, like, the sun was up already at, like six o'clock but it was like really hot already and I was just like well that's crazy and then I had work obviously and it was alright you know standard you know I'm not gonna keep saying it's boring it was fine you know um, also I noticed that I talk in a northern accent way too much way too much so that was that and I finished at three o'clock and then I went like round like my like the city I live in and like was looking for birthday presents for my mum and like there's this amazing little um junk shop slash vintage shop and it just sells like the most amazing random stuff ever from like you know just ev everything and actually that's why I guess it's called Snoopers Paradise because they have everything dotted around everywhere and it's just like you literally have to hunt for it and it's like they have things in things and it's like pretty cool so I got this some cool stuff and then I brought some new shorts which I don't know if my my thing but they are pretty cool look can you see that they are very stripy do you like the nautical thing they don't go with this t-shirt but you know you can't have everything um, I was surprised that still stayed in my eye and quite impressed with that. What else have I done? And then I got obviously came home and I bought a pepper and some mushrooms. Yes! And what I'm going to cook with those, a pepper and mushroom mix. Boom, boom, mix. Boom, boom, mix. Yeah, that was that. And now I'm here. I was going to go on the beach, but it's that, I don't know, I'm tired. I'm tired now. Like, I've walked like four and a half, five miles, but you probably don't care about the song of the day is because it's so like oh no Ew. that's scary didn't it speaking of scary how weird was like the orb slash blatantly was like a little fly that dro like drove 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 when does a fly ever drive I mean, when does a fly, you know, uh, the fly fly flew? <laughs> anyway, no, the, the fly flew past, but it could have been an orb. <gasps> an orb? An orb, you say? Oh my god. Looks like I will actually have to call Derek Akora in. That was that. I would say that was that, or basically, basically, that was that. And at the end of the day, basically, it, that was that. <laughs> anyway, so I did it again. I need to stop. Like I need to boost my vocabulary when it comes to vlogging. The song of the day is because it's so nice and sunny. Is Bob Marley and Funk Star Deluxe or something? Sun is shining. Such a tune. Neat brav. Yeah, it's like well amazing. Like I have never heard like a proper summing tune. It's like banging, isn't it? Blah blah blah. My question for you today is, if you had to take a bullet for someone, um, who would you rather take a bullet for? Would you rather take it for the president of the world, this is obviously if the world was slightly different to what it is now, but the president of the world was a fat overweight goose, but if you saved the goose then world peace would be remained for at least another thousand years. Or would you take a bullet for a statue of a banana and it was a holy statue and the, if you got in the way of the statue being damaged and, you know, marked in, or, you know, in some way by a bullet, then you would be made a martyr and also peace would last for a hundred years. So do you want to be the martyr who saves a banana statue or do you want to be the real good guy who ensures peace for over or oh, at least a thousand years to save a fat goose. Look 
Can I have a tour of the garden? Do you want a tour of the garden? All right then. Okay, all right. Now you've said that. Look, I've got little sparkly owl socks. Are they not the most amazing things ever? They are <coughs> women's socks, but the less we say about that, the less you need to know. Let's play the game. What have I got in my bag? Who can guess what I've got in my bag? I'm going to give you five seconds. I wonder what your guess was. I bet you didn't know what it was, but here it is. Mushrooms, mushroom, mushroom. They're like little ske ske like sketchy little Pokemon. Um, I'll, I'll take you out in the garden, but I don't like speaking out here because people think I'm weird. So if I just push the door. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Blind you. Look at the pretty flowers. So, look, all the weeds have gone. Look. Isn't that not amazing? I've de-weeded everything. Palm tree. Bamboo. Boom bow. These like little Pokemon. Wee boom bow. Wee. Right, so that's that. Um, I don't know how many people are looking at me right now, but I don't care. So I might just keep it there. Um, hi. We could play the throw dirt at the snail game. There's a snail. This is going to be a difficult game. Oh, missed it. I give up. Camera died. Love you, miss you. Bye.